what's up guys so update on the <clears throat> angelfish breeding setup here at home a few tanks are pretty empty now because we took um, all the babies to the shop so I'm gonna show you what's left we still have some of these guys uh, we're keeping them here a little bit longer um, letting them grow out a bit more and then we'll be taking all these uh, to the shop same thing with these we're letting them grow out, grow out a little bit more and then they'll be going to the shop this is the main black marble pair These are the smoky, or the, I call these smoky. Nice super giant veil tail. And then regular, I believe that's female. This one's the male. Small batch. Looks like that one's empty. Uh, pretty decent batch of babies. Same thing with this, this is a pretty big batch. Empty. Here's a group of red, red top tapajos. Still haven't seen any breeding from them. Nothing yet. But hopefully soon, if they don't breed, then we're gonna sell all of them. But there's one, two, three, four, five. Uh, there's six in here. Two super big ones. Uh, those are probably five inches. And then the, the rest are about, oh, the water's cold. Uh, about three and a half, three to four inches. There's one pretty nice batch. Uh, probably black marble. Oh, black marble with some um, uh, gold veil tails. Uh, guppies. Another batch. These look like. Uh, oh, big mosquito. Yeah. Get over here. Yeah. Nope, I missed. Uh, these are the wild Manacapara. Or Manic Peru. This is the wild. These are F1 Manic Para. However you want to call them. Uh, we kept these. Because these don't have lines. We want to line breed them. So they ca keep that black band. On the back dorsal. Tail. And anal. Of the black. Black eye. And silver body. Male looks pretty similar to that. So we want to see if we could line breed that style. Discus pair. Still haven't seen no breeding for, from them. Uh, I will sell them if anybody's interested. Uh, $200. Uh, just because these are super badass. Especially that. That's the female. This is the male. Is what I'm thinking. Because I was sold, that one was sold to me as a female. <clears throat> so that one has to be the male. And if you bought any of the discus from me before, uh, some of yours will turn out like that. Because that's an uh, older sibling to the ones I um, you bought from me. So just give it some time, yours will end up looking like this. And he colors out some more if you've seen the pictures I've posted. This is the blue marble pair. This is the pair that gives me six different colored babies. Okay. So they give out uh, some black marbles, blue marbles, a couple smoky colored ones. Uh, they give out uh, these see-through ones 
they give Philippine blues, they give a few platinums, they throw um, albinos, but we haven't had any albinos in a while. Um, and they throw, what other? Can't remember, I think they throw like one or two more mix colors. Well, that's them. This is the best pair ever. Then this is a gold veil tail angel pair. I took all the babies to the shop. <coughs> this is, there's supposed to be some wilds in here? No. But it looks like they're um, a few gold veil tails and black marbles. My dad just brought these. To, um, I had them at the shop, but they weren't uh, breeding well. So he brought them here. That way he has more control over them. These are regular uh, Philippine blue. And then this is another smoky. Where's your female? I wonder what happened. Unless she's hiding back there. Then just regular black angels. <coughs> and then over here. Uh, this is where we were trying to breed the Nairite snails. There's no breeding which sucks. Um, I always try and take a peek but I don't see any of the little egg sacs on the glass that I've hatched. And don't see any anything that looks like baby snails on the bottom either. So it's probably a bit harder to breed the Nairites successfully. They might need like a brackish setup. And then the other fish swimming in here are brine shrimp. You could actually breed those but it's not really worth it uh, on a small scale. This is just where he dumps uh, the extra water from the brine shrimp, he just dumps it in here. And I'm pretty sure he has tried brackish, and then super salty water, or super, or a lot more fresh water. And in here is where we're breeding the assassin snails. Uh, there are eggs, uh, right there, little egg sac. Let's see, zoom in. That's a little egg sack. And there's some hydra in here. That that thing's hard to kill. Oh, is that a baby Nairite? Let's see. That right there. I think that's a baby Nairite. No, not Nairite. Um, assassin. I think it is. And right there also. So we can mark that off as being successful breeding. And we had guppies in here but we were thinking that they were eating the baby assassins. So we took them out. So that's pretty awesome. And then, uh, I don't think, the last tank is the pond, and here we have a bunch of more angels. Looks like there's some gold, the gold veil tails, there's black marble, there's black. Uh, blue marble, the pearl scales, 
can't see it's pretty dirty, but it's because he my dad feeds heavily. So it's pretty cloudy right now. <clears throat> but there's probably 500 angelfish in there. You can see them right there. But these will be the ones that will be up next to go to the shop. These guys, those, and those will be next to go to the store but let me know if you're interested in these discs look at them super nice two hundred dollars <throat> uh, if someone was interested in the red top geos i sell them too take all of them though uh won't be cheap either either uh, I'd say so there's one two three four five six yep six So I'd probably say probably like 200 200 for all of them and that's pretty cheap You can see the guppies This these are some of the my line since we had a bunch of them, we brought some here to the shop. Only a few of you guys saw my females that they were giant. They had giant tails, tails bigger than the males. Yeah, see you guys later. Then this is where we have Daphnia and grow out some of the baby plecos. And we have some more uh, Nanakara here. That's male. There's around six of them in here. Yep. Uh, there's one, two, three. There was another fourth, five, six, seven. So I think all, or there might have been ten in there. But these will probably take home, take home, take to the shop, maybe Thursday. <clears throat> okay, see you guys later.